go to this question. Why we have uh, triangle subtended by a tangent and a chord. So this one, in the first place, identify the chord. Uh, the, the chord here we have CD. That makes this angle an angle of 50 with tangent ECF. This angle is 50. Then we must have another angle, which is 50. We must have another angle, which is 50. We must have another angle that is 50. So if this angle is 50, which other angle is 50? The angle can be 50. This angle is 52. Because the angle accord makes the tangent is equal to the angle of the same chord subtend in the opposite segment. Subtend in the opposite segment. So this angle is 50 degrees. And then we are told that this one is equal to this. Then meaning the size of this angle. And this angle is equal. So therefore, 180 minus 50. You get one of that over 2. This becomes 65, and then 65. So this angle is 65, 65. So let's go to this question. Find angle B, C, E. B, C, E. This angle. This angle here. If this angle is 40, this is 65, and this is 50. What angle C, B, C, E? The angle of that one, BCE, will be 180 minus 40 plus 65 plus 50. You add all of them and then you subtract. 40 plus 65 plus 50. You get this is 155. 180 minus 155. 180 minus 155. You get this 24 degrees. So this angle is value of angle BCE is 25. You can see, you start with this. There's a tangent, there's a chord. The angle subtended by the chord is equal to the angle. The angle subtended by a chord in the alternate segment is equal to the angle the same chord make there. Tangent, so this angle is 50. That angle there is 50 degrees. That angle there is 50 degrees. So you have this. So that's 50 degrees and this is 50. Then from there you start property. This property. So therefore, we have this angle. This side is equal to this. So these two angles are equal, which is equal to 65. And then this angle is 25. If this angle is 25, which other angle is 25? This angle B, C, E is 25. This chord makes this angle. The same calls after this angle. So this angle is 25. So therefore, the value of angle A, B, C, which is this, A, B, C, will be equal to what? Will be equal to 180. 180 minus 25 plus 40. 180 minus 65. You get 115 degrees. So this angle, angle ABC is 115 degrees, which is the same as the whole of this angle. Because this is a chord, this is 65, no, this is 50. That's 115. This angle, this angle, this chord makes this angle with the tangent, the whole of this angle. So, therefore, this call subtend this angle in the alternate segment. So, therefore, the value of angle Y is 115 degrees. 